Oh my gosh, I am so excited because I went to Bath and Body Works semi-annual sale. So this is going to be my Bath and Body Works semi-annual sale trip one. I plan on making probably a total of three trips throughout the whole entire semi-annual sale. But this first trip, I just wanted to get candles that... Um, just came out for the semi-annual sale the ones that I really really wanted and I got all of them they were really going like hotcakes like people were coming up to me saying oh my gosh where did you get that candle I'm like over there and bam like three people like just darted over there it was crazy and this is an outlet store um so each one of these candles I got for $11 and then um, I bought three per transaction which equaled 33 and then I used my $10 off of 30 coupon. So that brought, where are my receipts? Oh, I don't have them. That brought each candle to $7.66, um, which isn't bad at all. They probably will go down cheaper, I'm guessing. But for my sake, I needed to get them now just because they could be gone. And I'm the type of person where I have to get them and go or I will be kicking myself in the arse repeatedly if I don't get them. So I'm gonna start with my very favorite candle of all time through the semi-annual sale and this is mint chocolate. Holy shiznets, this is the best candle I've ever smelled in my entire life. First of all, I love the color of the wax, it's that mint green. There you get the ice cream on the top. The um, description reads semi-sweet chocolate, dark cocoa and peppermint with vanilla cream and white chocolate. Holy crap. This is like if you were to buy a Kemp's um, gallon or half gallon container quart of ice cream in mint chocolate chip. And you know when you first open it up and you smell that mint chocolate chip scent? This is it. Like, this is it. Go get yourself this candle. I swear to God, it's the best. So, I picked up four of these. There's one, two, and three, four. Because I had to, um, I got nine candles all together. Four out of the nine were those. Um, so now let's get on to my next ones. Um, I basically got one of each in the other candles. Um, so let's get started with Salty Caramel. I have this candle already. Um, I bought three at the time, burned two, have one left, and I just wanted to stock up on another one. I really love the label. Um, and the description reads sweet cream and caramel sprinkled with glazed pecans. That's exactly what it is. It's caramel, but it's like salty, salty caramel. Like you really get that salt note in there. And it's just sweet and delectable and it's so good. I love it. Um, next, I got caramel apple. This is another favorite of mine in the fall. And this one reads... Golden apple, brown sugar, and creamy caramel are blended with azure pear, nutmeg, and vanilla cream. I don't know if I pronounced that right, but whatever. It smells really good. It's just your basic um, carameled apple, but I can also smell the pear in here. It smells really good. And this is, like I said, a favorite for fall. Um, let's see. Next... I got Kitchen Spice, and I just picked up one of these because Kitchen Spice smells a lot like salty caramel. To me anyway, it's just a little bit more on the vanilla side instead of the salty side. So this one smells really nice, and I don't know if I showed the label. That's the label. And this one reads, a comforting mixture of nutmeg, allspice, hazelnut, and caramel. So this is just really, really good for the kitchen in the fall time. Um, I'm going to have a lot of fun burning this. The next one I got was Ice Cream Shop. And this one I wasn't too sure on in the store. I don't really like scents that are just vanilla scents. 
and this one kind of is. It says, just the perfect ice cream sundae, creamy vanilla rich toffee and sweet almond blossom with a cherry on top. And I get the sweet almond and I get the cherry on top, but it's more vanilla to me than anything else, which is okay. Um, I'm still on the fence with this one. I don't know if I'm going to return this one and get another candle. Um, possibly. No, I won't. I'll keep it. So I do like the label too with the ice cream and stuff. And then the last one I got was homemade cookies. And these have chocolate chip cookies on the front and it reads whipped buttercream and pure cane sugar mixed with vanilla bean and rich sweet cream. And it smells, I mean, there's no real chocolate in here, so I don't know why they have like a chocolate chip cookie on the front. It would have been nice if they named this chocolate chip cookie or homemade chocolate chip cookie and added the chocolate scent in it. Um, but yeah. I mean, it's, it smells okay. This one and Ice Cream Shop are very, very similar. Um, they both kind of have that vanilla, creamy type of note to them. But all in all, I was really impressed. Um, a lot of people were around the store. There were kids everywhere. Parents didn't care what was going on. So I was going to try to kind of look at the body care stuff today, but then I thought, you know what, I don't really need any right now. I'm just going to wait the semi-annual sale out and see what happens. So, so that's it. I'm so excited about my mint ice cream. Oh my God, my mint chocolate ice cream. It's so good. Oh, love.